was next. Antonio Brown. Seems like we cannot go a day without talking about this man. It's been nothing yeah. but a saga story. Uh, yesterday, we asked if he was going to finish the, the season with the Patriots. <laughs> now I think the question is, is he going to play one down for the uh, Patriots? Yeah. <laughs> if you guys have not heard, Antonio uh, Brown has been accused in, I believe, a civil court, not criminal court, civil court, of rape uh, from a former trainer. Her name is Brittany Taylor. Uh, just some food for thought. I heard she works for the Oakland Raiders now as well. So take that as you will whatsoever. But there are, there have been three instances of where Brittany Taylor is accusing Antonio Brown of sexual assault slash rape dating back right. to 2017. So what are your thoughts on this? Um, at first, you know, first glance, um, without reading anything, I'm thinking, oh, it's a money grab. Another woman coming forward, a guy while he's down. However, she's it's only, only asking for 75000 Right, only asking for 75000 Now, when I heard you say that, I thought the same thing, only 75000 right. for a rape. Mm-hmm. Um, but I heard that they had to just put the 75000 out there just to get in the door to get the indictment going or whatever it is to be charged in the civil court, that that thing's going to go up to a million dollars. I'm sure it will. Does it, because it actually, she's saying it was a rape. So I'm thinking to myself, okay, you know, it's another one. Listen, I, you know, I don't really want to question women too hard, but I, I sometimes I just don't understand how you wait this long and da, da, da. Although, you know, it's 2007, 2018, so it's not like she's waiting 10 years or something. But, um, but then when I, so I'm thinking it's a money grab by her, you mm-hmm. know, in, in that, like, oh yeah, another another one of these, right? But then, flip the script, things evolve. You read more stuff. I read the emails. I read some of the emails. I read some of the text messages. Dude, Antonio Brown's a – I mean, we already he's, – he's an idiot. He's a moron. This right. dude's not a good right. dude. So by his own admission, something happened. So it's not like she just one day got the phone and goes, you know what? I've been working with Antonio Brown for three years. You know what? I'm just going to accuse him of rape. She's not – you know, at first you might think that. She's not doing that. When you read the the the, the emails and stuff, I mean, he he's, he's, coming, he's having sex with her while she's asleep. He's actually even admitting that – Why'd you make me feel that I had to like sexually assault you? Like, dude, like you're, you, Antonio Brown's language sucks. Well, he's gonna have to come out of pocket. Yeah, right. So, so I have not read the emails. Yeah. I I try to read that first line, and like any time when I have to read something out loud and try to make make sense of it, I'm right. not going to like read it. Like he was using short shorthand and the U and the R. I was like, come on, man. Like you are a college educator. <laughs> Ed- educated professional it athlete is. learn how to write a freaking email but with that out with way like like with that out of the way from 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 what you are saying to me like i'm i'm taking your your like your word at this i have not read into this at all uh, meaning the emails um if you are admitting that you felt like you were raping them or doing this or or like doing that why did Brittany Taylor keep putting herself in that situation? True. So uh, I, I, I'm not saying that she is totally innocent or Antonio Brown is in, in it, this happens three separate times. Right. If, if the first time you felt like you were a victim, why did you continuously put yourself in that position over and over and over again? Not once, not twice, but three times. So, Yes, I know she was a trainer for Antonio Brown. I don't know if, if she worked for the Steelers, but I, if, 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 if I remember correctly from what I read, she was down in Miami. So she was even sure. with the Pittsburgh Steelers like, like at the time. And then I read that she is now working for Oakland. So I, I don't know how true that is or because, you know, Photoshop is a very powerful tool. Right. And you kind of kind of take it for what is worth that face value a little right. bit. Uh, so if this is true that she's working with, with the Oakland Raiders, I almost have to say that maybe Oakland is trying to poke the bear a little bit like, haha, you know, right. but I don't see John, John Gruden or a Mike Mayock really going down that, no. that, down, down that path too much. Maybe if it was uh, uh, Al, like Al, Al Davis still at the helm yeah. and it's happened, I could see that happening, but the like we've talked about this before. The Baylor guy, uh, he got a charge with with like rape. His career is over, you know. Uh, yeah. Now Antonio Brown is getting charged or not charged with rape, but uh, 
accused of rape, I should say. And yeah, this could quite possibly end his career too. He could never. Yeah. I, 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 if this goes any Dude. further, I bet you he is cut by the New England Patriots by Saturday afternoon, doesn't play it down for the New England Patriots, Dude. and he's never going to see an NFL team again. No, you're right. But hey, let me tell you something, man. That Me Too movement yeah. Is, yeah. ain't no joke. Right. Okay? Right. It, it's already out that he did something to her while she's asleep, and man. She, it, and, he, and he has admitted it. Like, passively he's admitted aggressively. admitted it. Passively aggressively. He's admitted, admitted it. it. Dude. Now, I mean, as a player, I can get over that. I'll be like, I'll look at Antonio. I won't want him around my daughters, but uh, I can be like, hey, what's up, man? Yeah, catch some football today. I'm going to block for you. Right. I'm trying to win. I can look past that. But some fans, man, and the Me Too movement, and some guys, man, they will not look past that. And and if you have any anything of where if he ever gets signed and it's a protest, uh, NFL teams will release his ass. Yeah, uh, this uh... – the uh, Michael Vick thing comes to mind. I mean, people yeah. were rioting in the streets for the Philadelphia Eagles for the first five or six six games, and then he started yeah. to win, and then it caught him, and then it all kind of went hush hush. So, See, I'll, yeah, no, go ahead. So, 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 like I said, like I'm not 100% blaming Antonio Brown. I mean, Brittany Taylor is to blame as well for putting yeah. her in that set, per, yes. putting herself in that situation more than once. One time. I can blame Antonio Brown 100%. But the second time, Brittany Taylor's got to take a fall. The third time definitely has to, like, why are you putting yourself in that situation? So Absolutely. I mean, but see, sometimes, Michael, the court, we as fathers would look at it like that. You know, like our daughters. Why do you put – listen, we're going to go – honey, look, if that's happened to my daughter, Yeah. I'd say we're going to go after Antonio Brown. Don't worry about it. I'm, I, I have your back. I'm your father. But in a little while – we're going to talk about why you kept going back. You see, the courts don't – sometimes the courts don't give a damn how much she went back. It's what happened. So yeah, – Like, like I, I see what you're saying about the courts, but sometimes common sense has to take over. But, like, why – so, like, why didn't she say something the first time that it happened? Right. Back, it, but, 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 but wait a minute, Michael. I'm going to play devil's advocate with you. I agree with you. Why the hell would you go back? Why the hell would you – what the hell are you doing? Right. As a father – that. But the, the but the courts look at the common sense of the what the person that did the act. Yeah. They're gonna look at Antonio right. Brown's common sense. Why are you pulling out your thing and ejaculating on her while she's sleep and all this stuff? The, dude, she's being that, that that's what happened. I, I get graphic. I mean, I'm telling you what the email right. like. She, he's admitting that happened. So they don't even care if she went back four or five times because she's not the aggressor. She's the idiot. You can't put all the idiots in jail. But the person <laughs> that should. did the act. Yeah, I wish. Um, <laughs> but the person that did the act, the crime in this case, is going to have to come out of a pocket of near a million dollars and may not ever be signed by an NFL team. Real quick on the Michael Vick thing, I was one of the most ones that care, could care less if he was fighting dogs. Right. I think, are you a dog lover? I like I, dogs. I love dogs, yep. Okay, but I, I really didn't care about it in terms of, hey, they're pits, they're fighting. I mean, I know some people you know, may get mad at me for saying that. I don't care. What I care about is how stupid Michael Vick was. He should get like you. He should get in. He should be put in jail for ten years just for being stupid. Right. I mean, how do you? How are you the the king of Atlanta? When you fly into Atlanta, there's a billboard of Michael Vick, not the mayor. You know, <laughs> right? Not, not a yeah. councilman. You're right. It's a billboard of Michael Vick. So you mean to tell me he's worth a hundred million dollars? All the endorsements, right? Oh, and by the way, I'm gonna have a dog fighting ring. That would be equivalent, Michael, to Beyonce having a side prostitution ring. <laughs> like, it, right. in other words, why would she do that? She would be a moron. So, okay. So, yeah. So, let yeah, me just stop you right example. there. Me, 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 like, I could care less if he had a dog fighting ring, too. But you are making $100 million a, like a year. You, you pay a guy to take the fall for you. You're like, hey, man, here is $80,000 a year. If I ever get in trouble, for this, you are the ring leader. You are like so. I mean, like maybe yeah. maybe maybe this is just me thinking like a logical person. Like you always have I me. Mean, like I, I'm making a hundred million yeah. million dollars a year. I, I can afford to pay somebody a hundred twenty, hundred thirty thousand dollars a year, better yeah. their lives, and 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 you, like keep me safe for doing these illegal activities. You mean to tell me there was not one person in Michael Vick's circle or friend? That said, hey, Mike, nudged him. Like one day they're at the club, right? 
hey man, you still doing that dog thing, the dog, the fighting dog thing? And Michael goes, yeah, man. Hey man, you might want to cut that out, man. Like, like you would ruin your whole life. Uh, like how those, stupid. Uh, no, no, no. So th- you are thinking like a smart man there. Yeah. Be, be, because Michael Vick is your boy, but yet Michael Vick is my boy, and and like I have my hand out, and he's paying uh, me <laughs> money to just hang uh, around him, you know. Right. So so like I'm not going to question anything that like he does, but. I mean, we could oh, I got we could really get deep in that if you wanted to. Like, I just saw yeah. the thirty for thirty on Aaron on Aaron Her- on Aaron Hernandez again. Uh, you know, like okay. like how he killed his friend, or you know, I mean, like there are money buys you a lot of things, but it it does yeah. not help you being stupid or just just yeah, just just. What's stupid. crazy is Aaron Hernandez died, and there was like a clause in his in his contract or clause in his deal or whatever. Even if he committed suicide, yeah. That somehow his daughter now is going to get all the money and his and his wife. That had he lived or something, they wouldn't have got as much money. Right. So man, he basically right. killed himself, you know, for for them. I mean, well, that's pretty intense well, stuff, man. He was going to be in jail for life, yeah. like uh, just like just like, right. like like anyways. But back to the Antonio Brown thing, yeah. the whole email situation, him basically admitting to whatever he has done. Why is he coming out publicly saying that he has done nothing wrong, dude? The emails say that you felt like you raped her. Like, yeah. why don't you just say, you know what? I made a mistake. Let me take care of this issue. Issue a public apology before it goes to the court system. Like, this should have never yeah, have, like, hit the press at listen, all. Yeah, I mean, if you – listen, I wouldn't be in that position. But if you've already admitted that 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 you, like, felt like, you know, like, you know, you had sex with her while she was asleep and da 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 I would say – I mean, I, I'd come out and I'd tell. I don't know if I. I don't, well, my lawyer would probably say just to shut up. Right. Yeah. But man, I, I I would be look. I'd be like, dude, we've had a relationship for like three years. I've had sex with you a hundred times. Like, you know what I mean? So it's not like I'm met her one night and grabbed her and forcibly raped her. Like, I would be like, dude, I know this person. She's just doing money grab. So that's what yeah. Drew Rosenhaus and those guys are gonna do, and his and the lawyers and all. That's what they're gonna say. But the text messages, the emails look really bad, and so. I'm actually a little surprised that the commissioner hasn't put him on the exempt list yet. If I've read the emails they have had, and so like to suspend him until they figure out what happened. And I'm actually surprised that New England hasn't suspended him yet, yeah. to be honest. Uh, me, uh, being the devil's advocate, just like you were earlier, maybe they have to prove their auth- their their authenticity first. Yeah. Because we do live in the world of Photoshop. And like I can say Don or Trump says anything on right. on Twitter just by a simple clicks on the button on Photoshop, but reading the first like the first sentence of the language not to sound like a racist or or like anything just like that, but it sounds like an inner city black man trying to 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 like talk. Uh, I mean that, that just just from that first sentence. That yeah, that, no, no, that, I read that, the whole that, thing, that and yeah, I mean it's pretty much slang and stuff like that, yeah. man. I mean, I, yeah, you would think. Yeah, you think you know a college educated person would 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 it's that's not gonna look good either. That's not gonna look good either in the in the, in the in the court system. Those emails are gonna look terrible. Right. Uh, so yeah. like the one thing that comes to my my mind is what has happened from 2018 until now that all of a sudden causes her to come out and be like, hey, I'm going to release these emails. I'm going to file this like do you think he was paying her on the side and then and then and like all of a sudden it's like well sorry like you got your fill you know like, yeah. like i like i like i wonder what happened what, what do you think think happened that's hey that's possible man she was getting paid i mean think about it. i mean that's why she went back those two and three times and four times five times right i mean right. because you know he's paying her she's, she's getting money man so it's money money is money is something man. like so <laughs> he's paying her so and then plus he had Man, uh, this guy had a had a, had a girlfriend, you know, who he has a bunch of children by, or at least a couple of them by his been. So I mean, you know, he's doing this while he's with the girlfriend. I mean, he just doesn't. I mean, we've all done our dirt or whatever, but man, he just doesn't come across. He's got to have other issues, man. She might want to get rid of his ass. I mean, the girlfriend. Yeah, I mean, uh, I listened to the to the darling to to the uh, Sterling tapes. I mean, like, money is a very powerful thing. So like, you can have a cheating husband for. 60 plus 60 plus years but but as long as he's giving you money things are yeah. hush hush but w- with all that being said let's let's just go on and move on from that uh i i'm honestly getting tired of talking about and Ant- and like antonio brown 
But I'm yeah, sure I mean, we'll, it's, I'm sure we we'll have to talk about it on Friday too when he yeah, gets I back. mean, so right, it, it, it's like what's next, dude? Yeah. Like, <laughs> is he gonna be attempted robbery or something, or what? Or is he gonna show show up nude at training camp with no helmet and no pants? Or what is he? What's what's next? Is he gonna wear a? Is he gonna do a Odell Beckham and wear a watch? during a football game let me ask you oh here's another would i played football for seven years it never crossed my mind to wear a watch during a football game i thought that you couldn't do that like why would you wear a freaking watch in a game well like, i have I, a I couple high school kids that have watches on simply because they, they just they, they they just forget to take them off now they're not three hundred fifty thousand dollar watches they're like a 25 dollar watch from kmart or so you know but, but you got to watch out for that stuff because, yeah. you no, know, like, you know, he could scratch somebody or, mm-hmm. or it could it could be used as a nearly a as a weapon. I mean, yeah. I, it could go in my eye. Yeah. Football is crazy. People don't understand these arms and fingers. And, dude, I played football. You know how many times I've had I, I'm in the I was in the trenches. You know how many right. times I had my arm bent back going the wrong way? Like, <laughs> it, you know, like I there's times where I didn't feel my elbow for a play. Yeah. Like literally, and I'm like, oh my god, you know. So, like, it, you know, anything can happen. Yeah. Um, yeah. with a watch, you get why, why touched you in places that you don't want to be touched hey, either. Hey, come here, son. Hey, hey, 84, take the wash off. <laughs> right. That, put the wash with your mommy. Yeah. <laughs> That's how I talk on the football field, man. You'd love me there. Yeah, I, I yeah. we we need some more people like you in the okay, area yeah. that I'm in.